Nana, I am so excited that we are going to make oats cookies. I can give some to my friend Pebble later when she comes to visit. What a good idea, Jiko. Let's start. One cup of flour, one cup of oats, some milk, some sugar. Hmm, this is looking good. Can you smell it? Oh yes, smells yummy, Nana. Can't wait to eat them. Oh, Jigo, I forgot the vanilla and the raisins. I'm going to go to the shop to fetch some. Please wait for me. And do not eat the dough. It is just enough to make 12 cookies, okay? No problem, Nana. I won't. Hi, who is it? It is me, Pebble. Come on in, Pebble. We are making cookies with my mom. Come to the kitchen. I'll show you. Look, we're making the dough for 12 cookies. Just waiting for some vanilla and raisins that Nana is bringing. Oh, that smells delicious. Can I eat it already? Hmm, Nana said not to eat the dough. Come on, let's ask the kids. This dough is so yummy. Should we eat some? No! Yeah. Oh, kids, you are so boring. It is just a little bit. Just a tiny little piece just to taste. Oh, it tastes so good. Really? Let me try. Just a tiny little bit. Oh, it's so good. Let's eat more and more and more. Jiggle, there is only a little bit of dough left. Oh no, there was enough for 12 cookies. Nana will come and know that we ate it. What are we going to do? I know, I know. I saw Nana making it. I will just add more flour. More, more, more. Perfect. It looks just like it did before. I will mix it. Great. We are so smart. Nana will never notice. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. Just in time. Hurry, hurry up. Pack away the flour. Hello, Nana. Look, Pebble is here already. Hello, Pebble. I took longer at the shop. There was a long queue. But here's the vanilla and the raisins that we were missing. I will add it to the mix. Hmm, the dough feels a bit heavy. Do you know anything about it, Jigo? No, Nana. Are you sure you followed the recipe right? Maybe it's just my impression. Okay, 12 cookies done. Go to play while I put this in the oven and I will call you when they're done. Yippee! Okay, cookies are ready. Jiggle, Pebble, come to eat. Hmm, the cookies look different. Let me try them. Oh, this is so hard. I can't even bite them. I know what happened. Jiggle, Pebble, come. Aren't you hearing me? Why aren't they coming? Hmm, let me see. This is my so painful. Is so painful. Ow, my poor, my poor little, little stomach. stomach. Jiggle and Pebble, you ate the raw dog, didn't you? How did you know, Nana? How did you know, Nana? Because it is not good to eat raw dog. Now you have a tummy ache. And you also spoil the cookies adding more flour. I'm sorry, Nana. We just wanted a tiny bit. And then it was a, a lot, and we also spoiled the cookies. I feel bad. I'm also sorry, Jigo and Pebble. You won't be able to eat any cookies now because they're spoiled. Neither to play because of the tummy ache. We won't lie ever again. Ugly things happen when we lie. Actually, this reminded me of what we learned in Sabbath school. Proverbs 12.22
The Lord dislikes lying lips, but he delights in people who are trustworthy. I want to be trustworthy. Me too. What beautiful words, kids! I think you have learned the lesson, and now can share with your friends. The Lord delights in people who are trustworthy. Shall we pray, kids? Yes, Nana. Let's pray. Lord God, we thank you for teaching us today to be trustworthy and not to lie. Please help us to be good, to be honest, to be trustworthy. Every day at home, at school, at play, in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. My mom, buddies.